Hello everybody and welcome back to Coral Island where I am really really hoping that today I'll be able to pick up these batteries. Yeah, very nice. I don't know why it counts up to a certain amount. I don't know whether that's because after a certain amount they'll stop working or what. Oh, Maku sent me a lemon in the post. Lovely. We've got a load of stuff to pick up today, but I'm going to actually start dealing with the animals first. I feel like that's just a slightly better way around to do things. So otherwise I end up just like completely clogging my inventory up and these guys get no attention. So uh, the only animal I'm petting at the moment, the only one that's not at full heart right now is the peahen or peacock, peafowl. And actually, I do need to go and milk and shear and all that stuff. Is it just the cow today? I think it is just the cow today. Oh no, it's not. There's something else going on. Goats, maybe? Can't see. Oh no, no, it was just, just the cow. Okay, lovely. So I think what I want to do is grab I'm going to grab the tarot root and I'm going to sell it again. And that will give me room for the eggplant and the pumpkins. Now I'm trying to think if a pumpkin, if an osmium pumpkin was one of the things I needed for the harvest festival. I can't remember, so I'm keeping them anyway, but I, hmm, I'm trying to remember. No, it was a cauliflower, wasn't it? Cauliflower and melon are the ones that we need to have. Okay, I'm just gonna put these veggies away. And then I'm going to head straight over to, well, I really do want to head straight over there. I'm going to move the bok choy over to a different chest so that the eggplants can live together for now. Going to see what I want to do with the eggs. We have three duck eggs today, so I will do. I'll make duck egg mayonnaise in one of them, and I'll use one of the large golden eggs in the other. I'm getting close to the point where I'm going to be able to have a thir third mayonnaise machine, though, so that's going to be quite good. Because at the moment I am super behind on mayonnaise making. All right, and we have one large milk that can be made into a nice large cheese wheel. And I have a goat milk that can be added to the uh, goat milk aging stuff that's going on. Goat cheese aging. Should be able to add that to. I should be able to add that to the barrel. Goat cheese wheel. Can't add it though. Okay, goat's cheese, if it can't be added to an aging barrel, will be kept in here until it can be, because it's definitely worth that. Whereas I don't think anything else really is. I've got a lemon to put in the fruit basket. Okay. Add a truffle oil to sell today. I've got loads of grape juice, which again will need to be aged into wine. I'll put that there. Stu I mean, I need a chest that's almost like stuff for aging. Honestly. Grab all the jam. I'll sell all of that. Now, I've been in here longer than I wanted to be, so I'm probably just going <laughs> to head out. I wanted to go to the lab. Oh, no, it's a Saturday. 
course it is. Of course I get all the batteries together on a Saturday. Because <laughs> because that's just the way my life works. Right then. Let's do a bit of selling then. I might do a bit of like undersea cleaning or something today. I don't know. Or maybe upgrade something. Oh, there's so much money. Oh yeah. Uh, we could always put in our... So I'm gonna put the battery in there. I could, I, I could put it. I could get our stable started, couldn't I? So, I think we have enough silver ore. Oh, I haven't started it going. Oh man, I should have done that last time. I knew there was something I needed to do, and I hadn't. Okay, let's start the silver bars anyway. I need coal, don't I? So I get five going now, and then I need to get some more for the house upgrade I want to do as well. So five will be enough for the stable. Then I've got enough for another two. So I need another like 38 uh, to do the house upgrade. And I also gonna need a load of stone, but I don't know how much stone I have right now. So that's something I'm going to go and check. The beach hut should be open today, right? So I could go and see how much I need to upgrade like my fishing rod, couldn't I? I've also got the... Mmm! Mmm! Let's go to the museum! I'd forgotten about all these things that I had that I hadn't handed in. Because I think I'm, I'm so few. I'm a tiny, tiny bit away from a town upgrade. Think. Oh, what? We already did the monarch caterpillar? Rats. Okay, well, it'll be the lab tomorrow then with the, uh, I'll take the fossils over. Maybe one of those will work. I guess I can sell you then. I thought that you would want to hand in. Guess you got sold. I haven't checked my insect traps in ages though. That's maybe something I should do. Kind of boring to do, but you know, it's something I could do. In fact, if I'm going down to the beach shack, that would be ideal to do that at the same time. I needed resin, but I didn't know how much resin. I know I need resin, hardwood, osmium essence. Oh, I might need five. Oh, yeah, I probably need five, don't I? Why is there no glass? I've used it all up, have I? All these grand plans and none of it's quite quite there right now, is it? Everything's like one thing short. But that's fine. I used most of that to get a mermaid tail yesterday and the mermaid tail was like totally awesome. So I'm not going to complain. But I'll put those there for now. Oh, the silver shouldn't be in there. Everything's in the wrong chest. You go in there. Cool. That'll do for today. So yeah, if I now look at the town uh, ranking, the museum is still at a D. It's got a little bit more to go, probably another 20 items or so to get to C rank. And I need one more, like one more donation somewhere to get the town rank B. A is gonna be really hard. A is gonna be like finishing off that final goddess altar and getting to level A. But then there's things not even put in for that. So I don't know. The museum is going to be it, isn't it? Which is why we need to get the 
the stuff up and running. Let me just go over to the beach anyway. I can empty the insect traps and I can have a look. I think they might be closed on a Sunday then. So I'll have all the stuff for the upgrade and they'll be closed on a Sunday. You watch. And then I won't, then I'll just about have enough stuff to do the stable upgrade and that won't be, ah, uh, you know what. It's just life, isn't it? Just life. Upgrade tools. Okay, so to upgrade to um, a osmium fishing pole, I will need one osmium kelp essence more. And I need 20 hardwood. I don't actually need any resin for that. Oh, okay. Resin must be for the watering can then. Pretty sure. Well, that's fine. Happy with that. And then it's just house upgrades and stuff. You look unusual. Oh, I think it's just a bog standard orchid mantis. Yeah, it is. And you're a soldier beetle, and you're a ground beetle, and you're a rove beetle, all of which I've already donated. Wah! And one of those guys, one at Caterpillar. I should pick up lotuses if I see them, really. I mean, there's a chance it may have picked up something super rare, but... I have like three traps on each location. Something's going on at the vineyard. Walter and Bree are having a tiff. Honey, this doesn't have to be such a big deal. I don't want to go alone. You're right. It's not a big deal. I think I overreacted a bit. I'm sorry for walking out like that. I just feel like we've been doing so many of these events lately and I'm getting overwhelmed. Hey, Sheila. Sorry you walked in on us like this. We just had a little disagreement, that's all. Honey, if you don't want to go, that's okay. I don't want you to if you don't feel uncomfortable. But I have to attend. This one's for my alma mater, so I can't skip it. But next time we'll choose together. Let's only go to the fun ones. Okay. I kind of do want to go, because then I get to see some friends. I just don't feel like going to a big gala. I'm not in the mood for fancy dinners and dressing up. What do you think I should do, Shelab? You should do what you want. If you want to see your friends but not go to the gala, then that's what you should do, I think. Because it is his event, so that's kind of what I feel. Yeah. I might just do that. I'll contact a couple of friends and see if they want to meet. Thanks for the insight, Shelab. It's a good thing to work hard and keep going, but I feel it's even better to recognise when to stop and take a break. Well, as long as you decide before next Friday, because I need to make hotel arrangements. That was very sweet. Hey Luke, would you like a coffee? I think I oh no, I put all my coffee away, didn't I? I remember. What kind of dude are you? Red Admiral. That's already in the museum, I know that. That's a swallowtail, I'm not even gonna bother catching that. Rove beetle. And another Red Admiral. That's fine. Could go see what's in the woods. But yeah, just looking forward to being able to know what's about uh, each day and what I can, can and can't catch. Playing Mantis, we've already had one of those as well. Or Ginseng, 
another atlas moth. That was a lunar moth, I think, which again, I've already had. I hang around a lot this time of year. I don't know why I'm picking up half the things I am, but we'll sell them all. I'll just make money out of them. It's fine. Back to the farm to empty out my inventory. Now I'll just make absolutely sure that nothing that I've picked up there is something that I can donate. Because if I could donate it, I would be very happy. But I'm pretty sure all of it has already been... Yeah. Don't need any more insects, which is which is why I want the fish one first. The fish is the only one that I have for the, that I need to put into the goddess altar. Keeping the resin, I'm gonna put that into the scavenger balls chest. The ginseng can be sold, I think, and then I want to put resin into building mats. I've got 146 stone, so I actually do need to get a couple uh, like 50 more. Because I think I needed a couple of hundred, didn't I, for the show. To the mines. We'll go to the silver uh, part of the mines. And if I happen to come across any gems, that's great. If I happen to come across silver, that's also great. But mostly we're just looking for the stone. I mean, it might be good to get dynamite for that. But if I pull things up manually apparently that's quicker uh sorry it's more likely to drop a rare item so it's quicker to find coffers and rare items and things like that that way all right so let's just start bashing getting coal getting stone all good stuff Water geodes, nice. Run around and see if there's any silver. Ah, okay, I think I think I need to go to the levels ending in five. A bit more, don't I? But let's um pop down here and see if I can quickly see any. There may have been silver there, but it wasn't worth getting. There's loads of stuff here. Wonderful. There's two crack in the grounds. I will need to come down with explosives, I think, for the house, though. Uh, because the house is going to take a bit more. It's going to take another 200 stone, isn't it? So. Go away, you and your cursed fragments. Right, so how much have I got now? So I've got 35 more silver. I need a total of 50. And I need a total of 50 stone as well. I'm just gonna jump down. But yeah, probably just for the house upgrade I will sort of Um, f sorry, for the house upgrade, I will probably bring explosives down because I'm going to need so much stone. We'll see how much silver now. 42. Hmm. So maybe I'll head back out and I'll go to like level... Oh, where's the way out? looks interesting oh no not as interesting as I thought it was it had a bit of a weird effect on the top and it made, made me think oh maybe that's like a gemstone or something but it wasn't 
Level 15, let's try that. What have we got on level 15? Have I already been to level 15? I'm not sure. Can't remember what I've done now. I cannot remember what I've done. But there is nothing here that's any good. I'll take a fossil node though. Fossil nodes and water geodes and everything down here. Like I say, you're more likely to find them because I've got like extra uh, pickaxe skills. Uh, I find more geodes. I don't know what the chances are to find certain things in geos. I'm not really certain on that at all. Right then, I'm going to head to level 25. See what I can find down there, see if I can find any silver. We don't need much more. I can always come in another day though, because this is for stuff that's well ahead. Okay, let's go back home. So tomorrow I'll be able to get uh, the upgrade for the... I need to take scrap. Is it scrap and stone or scrap and wood? I can't... No, it was scrap and stone, wasn't it? So that's more stone I'm going to need. So I really think I do just need to take some explosive threes down and just grab more stone. I know I get more stuff if I do it manually, but... Mm. Okay. Time to go to bed. Really like my bed. Although I might be able to get something even more fancy at some point. I definitely want to fancy up my house a bit. That wardrobe's terrible, for example. 90,000. I can't spend it fast enough. Goodness me. Right, but we're going to spend a lot today, so that's fine. Well, we've got more extra batteries. Wonderful. That's great. And I'll let the animals out for the day. Another large golden egg, woohoo! I'll let them out for the day and then I'm going to go over to the lab once it opens. Probably change the honey over for something else. What do we want to make today then? Do I have any more like Rafflesia or anything like that? No, I don't think I do. I've got a few lotuses though. Why don't we make some lotus honey? In one of them. And then we could do some Dahlia honey, maybe. Right, so. There's a lot of things we need to do today, and um, so I need I need to go and just get all the scrap out of my scrap box. I need water essence, and I need... Okay, so scrap, water essence, batteries. Think. The scrap stone and something else. Oh, was it scrap stone and silver for the horse? I think that was what it was. Um. Okay, so let's. I've got stuff in my monster. So let's grab the batteries anyway. So I actually have nine batteries now, which is almost enough for the two of them. I need one more and then I've got the two. And I'm just going to go straight over. Oh, water essence. I definitely need water essence. 
Wow, I really didn't have as much of that as I thought I did. That's as much as I've gotten from the whole time I've been playing this game and I've never sold one either. So that just goes to show, doesn't it? Alright, so into the lab we go. And I've probably forgotten something. Develop equipment, right, so... Oh, it's the gold and the osmium ore I've forgotten. So I need to go get go back to the farm and get uh, 10 osmium and 10 gold ore. Okay. I have that, I know I do. I better have the gold ore. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm certain I do, I'm certain I do. That's why I went to do this first. So I'm almost certain I put some osmium ore where I shouldn't have done. Yeah, I did. And all the coffee. Because coffee's quite a good, it's quite a good universal present apparently. So now you know. So I want to see if I can get some gold ore and then that should be enough for that. Yeah, we've got some gold ore. Perfect. My inventory is going to be a mess for a while, but it's fine. So back over to the lab, and then I will try my best to go to the carpenters. Oh, I didn't bring my fossils. I meant to. It's a lot to remember though, isn't it? So develop equipment, I want the fishing component. And then I'm gonna need some more osmium or a second battery and some wind essence and I can get the catching component. I could probably have that by tomorrow. I just need to wait for the battery basically. I've got the wind essence at home as well. And then the more batteries I make, the more things I can get. The forage component might be nice. Don't know. Temperature machines, I can make them then, but I can buy those if I need to, so those those are a really low priority because I have a lot of money. Auto feeder, silver kelp essence for that. I'll need to get a silo together and stuff for all of that, like automatically having them fed would be really good. Then all I'd need to do is just check that there's hay in the silo and we're fab. We're doing well. Is it the spooky festival coming up soon? Looks like it might be starting to get decorations for it. Uh, right, so now to the hillside and hope that I've managed to remember all the stuff. Because there's so much stuff that I'm needing today that it's kind of boggling my head a bit. Okay, so. Carpenter, stable. I'm missing uh, some of the stone that I need. Okay. I'm sure there's some stone probably in one of my building chests or something elsewhere. And then we'll get the stable done. Yep, there's the stone we needed. Get the stable done. No. Fast travel for the win. And then it's the fishing rod. But I don't know if the shack is open on a Sunday. I think it might be closed on a Tuesday or something. Stable. They can start building it there and then I'm going to move it. I'll uh... <laughs> 
That is the lovely thing about the architect's table. Everything can just be moved about. And it's not an issue at all. Okay, so the next thing I want to do is to go and make... Actually, I need to make it, don't I? Because I was waiting on the glass. I need to make that final osmium kelp essence. I could do a making six more, actually, because I'm going to need uh, the bugged net to be upgraded as well. I don't see why I shouldn't do that if I'm going to be getting into some catching stuff. Right, so osmium. Where's the glass? I oh, it's in my inventory. Okay, it's fine. I have very little scrap left as well, so I think what we'll do is I'll take some trash and start making more. And we'll make some compost as well, because my winter seeds will need sorting out, won't they? And this is all grape juice, so I've got more grapes coming in today. Haven't harvested them yet. Uh, so let's head outside and check the map and see what the opening times are on the um, beach shack. Monday to Sunday, 9 to 5, closed on Tuesday. So yeah, so they'll be open until 5 o'clock. I might, might be able to do it then. Right, so I would say probably the next thing that I really need to do. Well, I want to check the computer actually. That's the next thing I want to do. I want to know if I have to craft the component, if the component it just gets added to the computer, if I've just been given it. Oh yeah, there we are, fish forecast. So. Wow, I can get a zebra fish. I've never had a zebra fish before. I've had a mud skipper and a crab. Had those. Had all of those. There's no point fishing those today. Sockeye salmon, salmon, an archer fish. Have I had an archer fish before? And what I can do is I can, all of the others I've had, and goldfish as well. In the pond, I can get a shrimp. Oh, I need shrimp and a tiger barb. Oh, it tells me if I've caught them. What? The giant snake head in the forest river in the morning I haven't had. Oh, I... What have I not? Handed in a sockeye salmon. I so have. I could have sworn I had. That's super confusing. Right, so I'm going to put away some of the geodes and things. But yeah, that is confusing. But yeah, I should help. I should be able to do a lot for the museum with that, which is really good. Um, but I'm confused about the sockeye salmon. I could have sworn I had handed that into the museum just recently. <sighs> okay, my inventory's driving me mad, and so I just need to. I just need to sort it out. Um. So batteries back in here, building mats, stone back into building mats, sell my mayonnaise, doom, 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 grape juice uh, needs to be kept, 
Then I've got flowers to go in my flower chest. Get like really, I get like really upset when it gets overwhelming me. I'm like, no. Oh, I should have sold the cheese wheel. That's fine though. Okay, I will go and pick up the peacock further. Is it a lot? Ooh, that's a goddess thing. Finally. Where are my shears? There. Are. Okay, so we've got. Oh, do you know what? Even. No, it won't. It won't. It won't. I'm going to take the uh, fossils to get sorted out. Basically. I'm sat here trying to get everything done with an inventory full of stuff, trying to sort the inventory out, knowing that time is ticking down and I really want to get the town upgraded basically. That's that's the deal. So, protest the fossil remains. And let's see if anything new comes out. And if it does, then that will That'll be our town rank up to B, I believe. Okay, so I've opened all of those. Let's see if any of them haven't been donated. That one has, that one has, that one has, that one has, that one has not. Pterodactyl skull, off we go. Let's head down to the fast travel. And then I'll try and get the catching stuff done as well soon and uh, we'll try and fill everything in then because that's going to be super nice having that computer. Right. Uh, no, museum. <laughs> oh, my brain, honestly. But having the town to a B rank is what you need for the last two animals. A rank is not necessary for anything for the goddess altar. B rank is enough. At the moment, anyway. So, pterodactyl skull. Three points. Town rank B. Town rank up. New decor at store. Unlock llama and the luwak. Yes. Which means I'm going to need names. I wasn't expecting necessarily to get that this episode, so I might need to just you know, bear with me while I find some names for them. Um, don't know if... I'll go back to the farm, actually. Don't know if the ranch is going to be open today, though. Yeah, the rest of the fossils can go into the cell box. Oh yeah, take the feather to the goddess. I was thinking to myself, oh, that giving that feather in is totally going to like give me extra po No, it wasn't going to. It wasn't going to do it. Because it wasn't going to finish a bundle. So now I can get the two to finish this bundle. Still looking for the red barrel, just need to find that. Rare crops, I'm hoping now I can get the cotton and the cactus. I don't know what month they come in, what season they come in though. And that'll be that one done. The catch altar will be finished when I catch the gator gar in the spring. Right, back to the farm. I want to have more of a look at... Ugh, this inventory! It's making me cross. It's making me cross with myself that it's not, not just sorted. I don't even know why it's making me so angry today. It's making me angry because there's things that I need to do. And it's just like, in return, it's sorting. And I'm like, 
No, it doesn't. But it really, really does. Um, right, I'm going to sell the sweet potatoes. Which should allow me to pick up the grapes. And I'm going to just take them in my shed and spend a little time in my shed. But I'm starting to feel a bit like, well, it's taking all my time and there's fish there that I haven't caught for the museum and I could have caught them if I hadn't been spending all day sorting my inventory out. So that's kind of where I'm at with that. <laughs> I think the star fruit needs to go today. Oh no, not all of it though. Okay, that's fine. Do you know what I'll do? I'm going to juice six of these star fruit. Okay. I'm going to juice three of the grapes. I'll just get those out of my inventory. I'm going to go and put all of the osmium kelp and kelp essence away. I'm going to grab that kelp essence. Oh, there's none done yet. Okay, that's fine. Uh, then I'm going to put some more silver on. I still got the coal in my inventory. Where's all the coal gone? Where it shouldn't be. Lovely. So that'll be for the house upgrade. Stable's on its way. Uh, that bronze ore, once that's smelted up, will be for another mayonnaise machine. Then... Let's put away, make the milk, make the milk into cheese. Come on, just do what I ask you to do. Yeah. I had the wool <laughs> selected, which is why that wouldn't work. Okay. Now then, the cheese wheel needs to be sold, the cursed fragment needs to be put away, the golden egg needs to be put away. Get rid of two of those today. Then, we're looking a lot better. Oh, the juice, the grape juice can go in there as well. The gold ore needs to go in here. Getting there. Just I have to take so much stuff out. So much stuff has to come out every time I want to run around and upgrade things, you know? But tomorrow will be Monday. And by then I should be able to hopefully do another battery. Although I might need to wait till the next episode depending on how stuck they get. But then that will be the catching altar done. Uh, not the catching, sorry, that will be the catching upgrade done. So we can see where all the critters are. And then we'll be able to also see where the forageables are. Now the forageables is going to be an interesting one. Because I'll be able to see at a glance on the map. Where all of the good forageables are. And I'll be able to go to them and check them out. So let's have a look anyway. Fish forecast. So Forest River. Uh, we need to go there in the morning or the evening to see if we can get a giant snake head. Okay. Town River. Giant snake head. Barramundi. And a sockeye salmon. I feel like the town river would be a really good one to fish at right now. Has three fish potentially that I don't have already. So it's already helping, look. So Town River is the one by the woodlands. I don't fish there often, so that makes sense that there might be things in there that I haven't got. But it's going to give me so much more purpose to my fishing rather than just being like, well, I might find... I'm writing it all down and 
La la la. Oh, I wish I'd got on that computer before. The first thing I catch is some trash. Nice. Good job, Sheila. But yeah, I'll just go to the spots that seem to have the most things that I don't have already. There we are, there's another sockeye salmon. I don't know why it doesn't think I've donated that, but it thinks I haven't, so... And then tomorrow, I'll go get a llama. I might be able to get a llama and a... Well, depending on how much they cost, they might be like 50 grand or something, but... Let's get a llama and the other thing. They're both barn animals, I think. But I've got loads of space in the barn. I've only got like four, four animals. Oh man, another one? Can I have some of the other things, please? But yeah, nice to feel that the fishing is going to be a little bit more intentional now. Oh, well, you're a dude, aren't you? There's the giant snake head. Wonderful. And there was a bar or something or other. But I think the computer is needed at this stage. You can't just be working on guesswork anymore. It's just too much. Another salmon. <laughs> well, any of these, I'll just keep some in the fridge and then we can just make extra sashimi for Raphael at that point. This might be another giant snake head, actually. I'm not sure they... That's a red snapper. I haven't had one of those in a while. But I've caught two new fish for the museum, so that's great. It'll be particularly important on rainy days to check that weather report as to check that sorry fish report as well. Normal salmon. I'll stay till midnight and just see if I can catch that other evening fish. This is a hard one. So it's either the new, the the one we don't have, or it's another. Oh, well, I said it was a hard catch, but it's actually a red snapper. Okay. This is a larger fish, might be another giant snake head. It would be lovely if I could catch all three of the fish that are potentially... Yes, it's a barramundi. That's all three. Wonderful. Um, I don't think I have time. Oh, where's the fast travel point? There it is. I don't think I have time to go past the museum with them, but I can uh, chuck them in later. Tomorrow morning. So I'm going to want to try and put them into the museum as fast as I can so that I can then see on the map what is and isn't missing. But if I can get three brand new, like, well, two or three brand new fish each time, that'd be amazing. Right, town rank up, new decor at store, new clothing at store, unlock the llama, unlock the luwak. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to very quickly check the batteries. 600 merits earned for that. Relationship increase with Alice, Antonio, Betty, Jim, Kenny, Leah, Lily, Ling, Oliver, Raphael, Randy, Surya, Theo, Valentino, Yuri. 
Brilliant. We only made five grand that day, but it's fine. Stable is also on its way. Doing amazing, right. So let's go outside and just check that the batteries, because I'll reload if we can't get a battery. But it looks like we can, so it's enough for what I need today anyway. I wanted to give you a recipe for spring frittata as a little gift. Don't let the name fool you. You can only you can make this sorry at any time of year as long as you have the ingredients. Hey buddy, so you won this time, huh? Well, I guess everyone needs their day in the sun. But don't get too cosy up there. You've just fired me up to push even harder. Daddy once told me, Bobby, winning is temporary, but being a winner is forever. And believe me, next year I'm reclaiming my victory. Enjoy your moment, she lab, because next year it's Bobby time. <laughs> okay. Well, that told me. That told me that it's Bobby time. So today, the things I'm going to do, and I'm actually going to... Just look after my animals first. Okay. Gonna say hello to them. Then I'm going to... I've got time, haven't I? So um, then I'm gonna have a look at my inventory and see how that's doing. Then I'm going to head to the museum and put the fish in that I need to. Sockeye salmon, giant snake head, barramundi. Then I'm going to head back to my house and I'm going to see what fish haven't been donated to the museum now that are around at the moment. The fact that I clicked on that and I was like, I saw three fish instantly that hadn't been caught for the museum. I was like, yeah, we need to go and fish over there and see what we can get. But now I've got all three of those. Let's see what else we can find, if anything. So fish forecast. So forest river. We've caught everything in the forest river. Rice fields. We don't have a giant mud skipper, apparently. Why not? Wow. Forest ocean. We have everything. Pond. We don't have a tiger barb. So we need the tiger barb. And the giant mud skipper. I'm sure I've had giant mud skippers before. I just didn't realize I was missing them. Um, I've got everything in the garden lane river. Giant mud skipper and a cod missing in the estuary. So maybe I could go there in the evening and try and get the mud skipper and the cod from down by the lighthouse. Right, okay. That's a good plan. And get the tiger barb this morning. There's a parrot fish and a barracuda down by the beach ocean. And in the dock says tuna and octopus. Okay. Temple Lake, we need to get a tiger barb. Okay. So it looks like the evening's gonna be a good time to fish at the town dock ocean or the estuary. Um, but I might just try and get the tiger barb for now. I'm I'm really super happy about this computer it's like amazing I'm so happy the way it works i didn't know how it was going to work uh, i hadn't looked anything up about how it was going to work beforehand so i'm going to go to the lake temple i think and i'm just going to see if i can pull up a tiger barb And I know that I'm probably going to be a little bit um, obsessive with fishing to start with. A 
but that's just the way it's going to be. You are a little bit, a little bit uh, sprightly, aren't you? You're a red snapper, okay. As I catch more of the fish, though, I'll probably find that I don't need to run around as much. Okay, that's definitely not a red snapper. That feels different. Tiger barb. Perfect. All right, okay. Let's get that into the museum. So that then it's not showing up as something all over the place that I need to catch. Donate item. Tiger barb. Rest of the fish I'll stick in the fridge probably, or or I might sell them. I'm going to be doing a lot of fishing, so so that's my morning fishing done. I think anyway, and then the rest will be an evening fishing thing. So I'll need to choose one place to go, and I'm thinking come the evening. Actually, parrotfish and barracuda. Uh, parrotfish, can I get that later? No, parrotfish is only the morning on the beach ocean. So let's see if we can get a parrotfish. I'll stick these other fish in the fridge. I really want to get the critter thing as well, though. Oh, man. It's gold... Battery, gold, osmium, and wind essence, isn't it? I know. Sometimes the only way to make any progress with the things you actually want to do in a day is to completely ignore some of the other things. So I'm going to bring those down and I'm going to get the other batteries. And that should allow me to add the critter component and then I'll add the forage components later. Once there's more batteries, but I'm not going to be particularly worried about it or anything. Uh, so I've got another four batteries there. Over to Ling's lab. It's more important to get things for the museum and stuff like that than it is to me at the moment than it is to get money. Getting the town rank up is more important for me. So I'm going to sort of do things accordingly. So develop equipment, catching component. So I now need more gold ore before and more batteries before I can get the forage component. But that's absolutely fine. It's not an issue at all. Um, a lot of these other automated things, I'm not that worried about having either. But knowing what's about for catching and stuff is really important to me. So I'm going to head over to the... Where was it? It was the beach, wasn't it? To try and see if I can catch a parrotfish. There were all these things that were hidden from me before because I didn't have the knowledge, but now I have the knowledge. Man, this beach is already looking like a mess. Really? I just cleaned it all up. Let's see. Can we find a parrot fish? A barracuda would be nice as well. But the parrot fish is the main one. A ruby red dragonette. I've had a few of those before. But yeah, like I say, loving the intentional fishing. Loving fishing knowing that there's going to be something. Knowing there's going to be something new. 
I'm actually gonna move. I'm gonna move. I'm gonna fish from this island. Who's that? Is that Theo? Yeah. Theo's just messing up my fishing, walking in the water, making a load of noise. Also doing some fishing. You just wanted to fish next to me, didn't you, Theo? That was that was it. Oh no, is the parrotfish still gonna be here in the afternoon? I wasn't sure about that. I should have checked whether when it went over to afternoon it would I would get any of those. Man, I don't want to waste my time. Oh, there's coconuts to be had. I should keep a few coconuts, I think. Yeah, I'm going to head back to the farm quickly. That was absolutely messy. <laughs> okay. That was so, so messy. I do want to go back and have a look at the... That is such a hidden one. I hate it. I want to go and see the, what the actual critter altar says as well at the moment. Why am I calling them altars? What the, what the critter catching forecast is today. So giant village. There is nothing new there. In the forest, there is nothing new. In the garden lane, there is nothing new. In the lookout, I might be able to find a widow spider at night. Okay. On the beach, I might be able to find a widow spider at night. Or in a town. Or in the woodlands. Okay. So look out beach, town, woodlands, all around that sort of area. You get these widow spiders. And the parrotfish would be there until four. Okay. And then after four, you get the octopus. Okay. So I could fish all day to try and get octopus and parrotfish. And then at night, at all the day insects are caught. It's just those little spiders at night. Whether I should be putting moving traps from the vineyard and then putting them down around the lookout and things like that to try and catch that spider, maybe that would be worth doing. I'm not sure. Or whether I try and catch them myself. Catching them myself, though, is a bit of a thing. Oh, do you know what I also need to do today? I haven't even started on is going to the lookout, to going to the beach shack to upgrade my fishing rod. And then I've got all these fish that I need to get, so... And all these insects I need to get, so it's like... Mm. Do I really want to be without them? I'll leave one here. So I'm just going to take two of those traps down to the lookout and we'll see if we can catch a widow in them. Would it be like in the grass around here maybe? Probably, like there. So how about we take an insect trap or two and we pop it maybe here. And maybe one over here. 
And I'll see if we catch any of those spiders. I might come down myself and see if I can catch them tonight. Because, I mean, thinking about it, like, if you look at my journal, you look at how many total um, insects there are left. There's only one, two, and it looks like the spider is there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more. We only have eight that we haven't caught. So, bug-wise, we're not doing too badly at all. Fish, sea critters, we've still got a load to catch, actually. But I don't believe that sea critters, it matters what time of year. So I just need to be down there looking around, seeing what I can find. But the fish we're missing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-five, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 111, 112, 113, 114, 115, 116, 117, so if I can, so if anything comes up on the insect report, it's like, yeah, I'll give that to me right now. Right then, so we probably want to go, I probably want to go back to the farm and sell stuff, don't I? I kind of want to go to the beach and like start catching octopus. I've forgotten where the... Oh, that's a fast travel thing. I'm gonna start using all of those uh, t those teleporting things because I can never find the travel the travel points. It's when I go to places where I've not been very often. To be honest, I have enough inventory space to catch a few different things. A lot of them are, they'll totally stack, right? Or I'll throw them away. Doesn't matter anymore. But the uh, but it shows me where I need to move my insect traps to as well. I'm not taking the fly out of there because I don't need any flying insects at the moment. Uh, let's have a look. I don't know whether fishing off the pier would be a good thing to do or just keep fishing down here. So we're looking for a barracuda and an octopus now. And in the morning time, we'll be looking for a parrot fish down here. Lobster. Maybe we can make some lobster bisque. I do need to try and get a shrimp. Uh, I think I can get them in my pond at this time of year. So I do need to get some of those to make the pad thai with. It's one of the few things for the um, rare cooking altar that I actually have the recipe for. And I know that I'm missing a shrimp for it. Okay, you're actually... No, oh, I thought that was something that's going to be difficult to catch, but no. No, it's an easy catch. Uh, perseverance will make a winner of me in this uh, particular competition. Whatever that is, it's easy to catch. I think the things I'm trying to catch will probably be things that are hard to catch. I'm not having a ton of luck, am I? If I really start to struggle, the thing to do might be to work out which kinds of bait are best. <laughs> what is this one? I need to know. I need some of the rarer fish to come and show their faces. Not just loads of blue tangs. Can 
Come on, be something good. Octopus. Flyer. I actually predicted that would be a flyer. It could have been a coffer, it could have been trash, but for... I'm apparently prescient. Mm. I'm going to try a different catch range. I wish I understood more about the catch ranges and what they did. Got a sardine, wonderful, just what I wanted. Not getting the, the rare things that I want though. I imagine an octopus is quite rare. And a barracuda probably is as well. I'll carry on fishing here for a while, but I'll try and fish in a few different places where they might show up. Problem is, I can't be catching widows while I'm doing this. Oh, that one has an interesting pattern. I wonder what that is. Oh, it's a lobster again. All right, I've probably got one more, one more try in me and then I've got to go to bed. Grrr. I'm going to catch you and then I'm going to bed. You better not be like, it's another lobster, isn't it? I can already tell. Well, it's lobsters for tea for me for the next few days, isn't it? My goodness. You never know them. I might have caught a widow spider in one of my traps. Why am I not going back to my farm? My farm would be a good place to go right now. There we are. Got some more batteries, so saving up now for the uh, forage thing, just in case it can tell me like if there's going to be any particularly rare foragers around. I don't know what the, the deal is with that, really. Okay, so my catching went up. I've got now got the flying insect scent, which I can add to my flying insect traps to make them get things a bit more easily, which is really nice. Uh, I forgot to put anything away. It's fine. I needed to catch things, okay? I've got lots of things. I've got four new things from the museum thanks to that. So, yeah, some of the harder ones not really showing up as easily. Now then, yeah, I think think it's time to end the episode there so i hope you enjoyed if you did then please do leave me a like below if you'd like to see more please subscribe i'll let you know when the videos are out i hope to see you next time in the meantime please look after yourselves and keep being awesome